Good morning, the church. Kia ora koutou katoa. My name is Moore. Uh, I just briefly wanted to uh, just share. Um, I have no connection to this church at all other than uh, Uncle Bobby. Uh, maybe there were some Maoris that may have gone uh, astray and the uh, Mona Nui Akiwa up there might have made their way here 200 years ago. I don't know. I haven't heard those stories yet. It's still to discover. But uh, uh, the thing I love about coming to this church, and I, I, uh, my first time here was uh, actually when uh, uh, Kahu Bobby was, uh, he, he came in, he'd been here one year, we had come and attended with my beautiful wife, Kayla, over there. And uh, it's not much different from my own home, my own upbringing, and uh, there's something beautiful about this church. Um, and uh, uh, it just made me think, uh, issues that we have here, it's not only contained to this island, but it's also on my island as well. And it's this, uh, it's called to the youth, to the young ones. <clears throat> I'm still quite young myself, um, I won't tell you my age, but you know. But uh, more importantly that uh, uh, our church, we, we don't have a, uh, a youth group. Uh, I think it's something that uh, not only pertains to this church, but to the churches in Kona, to the churches of, on this island, is a, is a heart for our youth. And um, something I'd like to uh, give to this, speak into this bowl is that we would reach the youth of this, this island. And that it would extend to the many churches that are here uh, uh, participating in today's celebration. That the, you know, in order for it to come this far, the word had to be taught. Uh, there was, was a responsibility on those that have the word, which is us here, to impart into the younger generation. And so, I just uh, want to share this prayer on the 200th celebration of this beautiful church, Kaipon, that uh, the youth, we speak to the youth of this nation, to the youth of of this island to the youth of the, the many churches that are located throughout uh, this island, Father God, that you bring, begin to bring in the youth of this island, Father God. Lord, that we won't need to be relevant, Father God, you have been relevant throughout creation, Father God, that, but that we will be truthful, that we will, that we will live your word and that they will see an example that they don't see on their computers, on their laptops, on their iPhones. It's something more deep. So Father God, this morning I pray for our youth of this nation. I pray for the youth that uh, this church here will receive. We speak it out in faith on this 200th celebration that we may begin to see more. We begin to look to the future for this church in the name of Jesus, we pray. So church, in saying that, in saying that prayer, there's a response by you as a church to uh, receive, to have grace for this youth because they won't come in all happy. Uh, they will come in with their baggages and uh, they will have many things that maybe you will not have experienced, but the Holy Spirit uh, and the truth of the Word of God uh, is more than enough to break through whatever problems they may have. I tell you, a lot of us have had problems in our past, but it was the Word of God that broke through immediately. And it's the truth too. It's not only just coming to church on Sunday, but it's really believing the Word of God that uh, Kahu will share. So I, I just pray that over this beautiful church to 200 more years of Kahu.